Hi, I'm Peter Burris. Welcome to a Wikibon action item quick take. Neil Radin, Teradata announced earnings this week. What does it tell us about Teradata and the overall market for analytics? Well, Teradata announced their uh, first quarter um, earnings and they beat estimates for both earnings and revenues. Uh, but they, but low, they announced lower guidance for the fiscal year, which I guess, you know, failed to impress Wall Street. But recurring uh, quarter one revenue was up 11% year to year to $302 million. But perpetual revenue was down 23% from quarter one 17. Uh, consulting was up to 135 million for the quarter. You know, not, not altogether shabby for a company in transition. But I think what it shows is that uh, Teradata is executing this uh, uh, transitional program, and uh, there are some pluses and minuses, but they're making progress. Uh, jury's out, but I think overall, I'd consider it a good quarter. What does it tell us about the market? Anything we can glean from Teradata's results about the market overall, Neil? Oh, God. Um, it, it's hard to say. Um, there's a lot of, uh, uh, you know, at the uh, EDW conference last week, I listened to the uh, keynote from uh, Mike Ferguson. Uh, I've known Mike for years, and I think I always think that Mike's the real deal because he spends all of his time doing consulting. And when he speaks, he's there to tell us what's happening. And he gave a great presentation about data warehouse versus data lake. And if, if he's correct, uh, there is still a market for a company like uh, Teradata. Um, so, you know, we'll just have to see. Excellent. Neil Radin, thanks very much. This has been a Wikibon quick take or action item. It's been a Wikibon action item quick take. Talk to you again. <laughs> All right.